who remembers the RGV Killer Beats? State Farm Arena, or whatever it was called back then, used to buzz when the puck would drop to the ice. Now, hockey players and fans, they're still here in the Valley, and they're looking for a new way to continue to grow the sport. And Kira Grogan takes us to the rink to check it out. Towards a cross release, shot in front, he scores! Aaron Lee, the Killer Bees, new goal scoring on top 2-0. When we as a hockey community lost the ice, uh, we were challenged to find an outlet. And thankfully, the city of McAllen has this beautiful facility that we're able to utilize, and we saw an opportunity to maximize what this facility actually is. Out with the ice and in with the roller, inline hockey has come to life in the Rio Grand Valley. Everywhere in the country that has hockey-related yeah. communities are drawn together to make a difference in the youth. One's Up Hockey is a youth program aiming to introduce the sport to any and all K-12 through grade students here in the Valley. I hope it becomes a little league where I can play with some of my friends and get more friends to come out and Join us. Jalen Strohs has been on skates since he could walk. I, that's all I knew since I was two. So I figured I'd lace up myself. From the beginning to the moment where they're trying to find their balance points. Oh, she scores! To the point to where they score their first goal. It's incredible to watch the development. Though the sport can seem intimidating from afar, 20 minutes in the rink may just change your mind. Get your first pair of skates and then come out as much as I can, as much as you can inside your driveway or uh, street and just, you know, just try to practice as much as you can. And then if that works well, then come out to us. Reporting from the rink for Valley Sports Central, I'm Kira Grogan. Now, in collaboration with the Dallas Stars, One Ups Hockey hosts a Learn to Play night on Tuesdays. You can find them on Facebook and find out more.